Hello, everybody. Welcome back to episode 8 of Inspire Gallery. What is that? <laughs> I've not seen that before. I guess I've not been paying attention very well. Oh, no. Did I investigate this already? Bro? I must have. Um, welcome back. Episode 8 of Inspired Gallery. Uh, after a successful transformation from being the bamboozled to the bamboozler, um, we managed to beat the Mantance Incorporated, or Mantance Headquarters Incorporated, Mantance Incorporated Headquarters, okay. Managed to beat that. Now uh, we've been heading into a new area today, the Lovershard Park, and finding out what kind of wiggery we will be dealing with today. No, just a... Regular old, regular old grass block that was there for some reason. Is there something behind that? No. Okay. Well, Lava Shard Park. Oh, and there's a couple spawners right there that I immediately want to get rid of. Do 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 do. Hello. Oh, hello. Hello? Hello, oh, you sulfur's coming from. Oh, okay. Well, that's a location. Oh. This jump boost is gonna be a night. Get out of here. That's a shoe! Um. Surfish, I swear. I swear. I don't know what to what, but I swear. <laughs> oh, I saw that swarm spark. Oh. Oh. No, uh, not there. Right there. Oh, there's one over here, too. Wiggy, did you make this symmetrical? Oh, that's a lot of spiders. Oh, no, 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 no. Where come from? What are you up to, Wiggy? What kind of shenanigans are you, you trying to... What are, we, what are you trying to give us? Lighting down where we can, where we can, where we can. Ah, uh, creeper. Ow. Is there anything in here? Water bucket. Sure, I'll take it. So rich, I swear! I don't know who I swear to, but I swear. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. Ah, ah. Okay. I think. We got that dealt with. A cute little vehicle over here. It's almost like a, almost like a playground. Arrows, I will take. Dragon best. I don't know why I'm taking, but I will take. Them. I can only hope that there's a traitor at some point because health will you just going. Hey, you want to make a? You want to make lingering potions? And you're like, no, not particularly. And then he goes, well, here's the, here's the bonus to make it. Like, oh, well, thanks. <laughs> okay, there is a cave spider spawner over here. I don't like it. I like it one bit. Don't like it one bit. All right. Show yourself. There you are. And cave spiders be gone. Don't 
Well, this can only be bad. <laughs> I can see nothing good coming of that, though. This, this is something good coming of that. Get myself a few coal blocks. Uh, I know we are running a little bit low on coal in general. Uh, so this is actually kind of nice to have. Dr. P, uh... Damn it, Wiggy. <laughs> oh, I don't even know if I want to look at that item. Lou, uh... It's not a terrible item, but at the same time, you're the worst, Wiggy. The worst. <laughs> uh, I want to take it out of... Because it's not... It's not a terrible item. 35 speed, 10 for max health. Not terrible. Not something I should be, uh bragging and showing off. Oh, that's a spawner. Bragging nor showing off. But, it's an item. Fire off. Um... Let me just toss this stuff over into our inventory. Containers, containers, blazes, stuffs. Uh, especially this five coal blocks. Um, like I was saying, we don't really have a huge amount of coal. I mean, it looks like a huge amount, at least for the moment. But realistically, it's like two stacks. Let's turn it into. Let's turn it into reality. Two stacks. Which isn't really a lot when you consider that uh, we'll probably need a ton of torches to actually successfully complete any of these areas. Uh, so, having these uh, small uh, coal deposits was kind of nice. Uh, especially because I don't really want to go farm coal. <laughs> don't really want to do it. Uh, okay, so where? Oh, where? Climbing up that. That was a scary, scary cave noise. Pretty sure that was a cave noise. Well, these are magma cubes. As much as I like. Oh, I really want to keep a magma cube spawner, though. Okay, you're, you're a magma cube spawner. As much as I really want to keep a magma cube spawner. Maybe I will. Keep one of them. And what are your light requirements to spawn? Do you have light requirements? I thought they did. Essentially, like every mob. Ah! <laughs> thought every mob had a light requirement for spawning. Okay, nothing new. Just a bunch of basketballs. I can't imagine Wiggy actually did anything with that. Ow. Stop it. Hi, Creeper. I can't imagine Wiggy did anything super special with that. Um, pool of fun. Potions of luck. I can't imagine Wiggy actually used any, uh, any, ooh, actually used any, um, uh, loot tables or anything, so luck potions aren't particularly that useful. And I did see this entrance way down over here. Oh no. No cover. I don't want to deal with your explosion. Gonna sneak over here and do some lighting while well, you fired it off. Fired it off. Ow. You're kind of hurting my feelings. Ow, and my soul. Come on. 
you know you want to you want you want to come in this this pit of despair whose despair is it mine yours we'll never know because you're all dead <laughs> all right wait what devious plans do you have the water variety you know I don't deal with the water variety just now yeah just yet I'll wait I'm gonna wait we'll go deal with the other terrible varieties that I'm most likely gonna be su suffering here soon um, most likely a lava variety but you know what you know what I have fire resist potions I don't have water breathing potions I can deal with the fire hopefully I uh, I thought I had two fire resist potions. Did I drop a fire resist potion off somewhere? Son of a... Where would I have dropped it off? No. No. Um. No. I pretty confidently can say I had two fire resist potions. Uh, drop it off on you. No, but you have fire resist potions. Well, I'm not going to complain about that. Uh, okay, well, that... I'm pretty sure I didn't drink it. Ha! Huh. I might have dropped it off in base. Okay, well, I'll... let's just run with it. I'm pretty, I was pretty confident I had two fire resist potions on me. Uh, and now we have two. So, win-win. <laughs> uh, what are you? Something that shouldn't be spawning. Anything after this point should not be spawning. Oh, hello, chest. Oh, hello, Cole. What do you have in you? Strength 2, Saturation 5. That's actually kind of useful. 5 minutes of saturation means we don't have to worry about hunger ever again for 5 minutes. Actually, probably more than 5 minutes. I'm going to drink it. Blah, 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 blah. Should I have drank it just now? Probably not. Oh. Oh, it's the leaf blower, people. The horrid leaf blowers. I don't know why they're blowing leaves at 8.30 in the morning. Because they have no souls, maybe. Uh, okay. I need to pause. Uh, so I, you all aren't bombarded by just a ton of that right there. Um, let me get to this platform. Uh, let me be right back. Oh. Okay. I'm going to bombard you with a little bit of it while I go deal with this spawner before. Oh. Oh. They almost seem like they're fading into the distance, but they're not. Ah, uh, beer back. All right, Leaf Blower Man is since passed. We will continue our endeavor. Oh boy, that's non-scary as lava is. With these magma cubes around, this is actually kind of terrifying. Because <laughs> all they have to do is poop us enough times. Oh, to lose health, and we die. They just have to boop us enough to die. And then the virus just doesn't really matter. Uh, oh boy. Now we cubes. You are going to be a nightmare. I don't know what that was, but I'm grabbing it. Just trying to clear up all this mess here. So that if we have to come back through this way, we don't have much any troubles. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Pardon me. Hello. Okay. Blazes, not too worried about you, except it's pooping. Seems like pooping is the ultimate factor here. <laughs> oh, more fire resist potions. I'm not going to take them all because I don't need them. Um, we got oh, almost four minutes of fire resist left. 
Uh, let's just get into it. Let's head up the staircase. Um. Thank goodness we have a fire resist potion, because this area would... Seems like it would be a nightmare without one. No, Skelly, no. Not welcome. Alright. Do do do. Oh. Oh. I don't think this area would be possible without a fire resist potion. Well, no, it would be possible. Which is extremely frustrating. <laughs> Especially with the lack of arrows we have. Oh, because we didn't farm arrows. Well, get rid of them. Oh, get wrecked! Oh, that's a lot of man cubes. Blaze! Don't need your sass. Cube still so much damage. Blow him up! Blow him up! Get him! Good job! Okay, they are still spawning. I don't know from where. Ow! Hey! Stop it! I don't know from where. Let's just get a little higher. Oh, because apparently they could get up to me, so. Um. I don't know where they're actually spawning from, which is a little disconcerting to me. Let's get over here where they get as easily get to me. Um, could be from one of those spawners there, which if that's the case, it almost looks like it's just creepers. Um, we should just get over here. Uh, let's try to deal with these spawners. There's the magnet cube spawner. I see it. I see it. Okay. We have a lot of nightmare around here. I wish we could, like, pseudo remotely trigger the creepers to blow up stuff. Hey, stop it. Creepers, hey! You look angry. Blow up! <laughs> Your mom! Oh! Now that kind of helps a little bit. Uh, let's get over here quickly. Get rid of this magma cube spawner. Um, oh, there's another one over there. Doop, doop, doop. Okay, that, make, that helps a little bit in the sh short run. And they don't seem to be too concerned with me at the moment. Saving grace, not really that interested. Uh, that wood, though. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of wood at base at the moment, so getting that wood would actually be probably beneficial to us. Uh, okay, let's keep going. And we're out. Like the demon's whisper. I don't know exactly where we're going. We're going somewhere. Hi, Husk. What are you doing here? Wiggy has gotten frisky in his age. Uh, in his old age. Okay. No, no, no. Uh, I'm just gonna get over here. I don't want to get knocked off. Okay. Oh boy, we are missing some gear. Oh boy, this is gonna get this is gonna get touchy feely. Oh no, creepers! Well, if that's how it's gonna be. <laughs> That's how it's gonna 
be. Um, I should probably go up here. I was gonna say I should probably Woo! deal with these spawners as a threat. dealt with. Since I have the fire resist still, I'm not too terribly concerned with the oh, dear Lord. the time or place. <laughs> Just want to light it up. Just want to be happy. Oh, those building blocks. That would have gone to waste. Okay. I think... I think we have this lit up. Oh, dear Lord. Okay. Uh, five and a half minutes. No pants, no boots. Barely any inventory space. Oh, we are going all in for a bad time. Wow. Okay. Oh, of course, there's a spawner over there. Excuse me, Blaze. I've got some things to occupy my time. Destruction of your birthplace is one of them. That feels like a really random cobweb. I'm gonna ignore the cobweb for now because I've got oh a ton of spawners to deal with. Excuse me, part of me, blah blah blah, spawner, spawner. Alright. Spawners that way. And Our spectral arrows. Okay. We've got a little over four minutes of fire resist left. Do I need to go over here to deal with these? I don't think I do. I think this is where the, the path I'm supposed to go. Go this way, go around, get to the bridge, versus just kind of going up to the side of the bridge there. Uh, I'll follow what I think Wiggy wants us to do. Just to be a nice guy. Alright. Then we get to this part where there's no bridge anymore. Oh, wait, now there's a bridge. <laughs> Joke's on you, Eggy. I know this is the intended thing to happen, but I can still still revel in, revel in that. Is there a spawner in the nearby? Oh, boy, that goes up really far. Come on, Blazes! Oh, boy, that doesn't look like fun at all. doesn't look like fun, because that's going to blow up our chest up there. Oh. How do I want to handle this? Um, so, creepers can spawn, jump itself into lava, most likely. I, I can't complain about that. It's at least made me try to get rid of some of this lava.
Is that lava behind that spawner? I think it is. It almost looks like if we break that spawner, we're good as sad. However, if we ignore it, ignore the problem. Ooh, sweeping edge three. Ooh. to that problem <laughs> uh, but yeah we get the diamond chest plate Woo and a minute of fire I don't know where you spawned from but I'm not going to invest too much time looking um Especially with 47 seconds of fire resistance going. Uh, let's try to... Continue on. We haven't run into a wool yet, which scares me a little. I wonder if it's just not, uh, not paying attention enough or what. Uh, let's drink another fire resistance. Uh, okay, that will hold us over for the time being. Oh, yes. Oh. oh, I see that spawner. Um, oh, it's the feathers. Oh, it's this boots. Knockback one, full knockback resistance, and feather fall four. I remember these. They were actually really good, and given that I have no boots, I think they're still really good. Um, all right, that will save us a lot of uh, save us from a lot of problems in regards to bridging because we can't get knocked back. Um, and, oh, hello, feather fall four, which will save us from a lot of potential fall damage that we'll most likely be taking soon. All right, stuff, things, oh, get rid of the cave spiders. Oh, it's an actual... Oh boy. It's an actual... Jockey spawner. You don't see that very often in CTM. It makes sense, because... You get range damage, you get melee damage. Two types of damage. Pretty solid, I would say. Objective three of five. Oh boy, that means we're missing. We've missed two. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I would lean towards bad. That's me. Lean towards bad. Oh, well, I know we do have that, uh, Pool area. <laughs> Good old Melvin. Getting wrecked. Okay. So we got three of five. That means there's at very least two more above us, two more below us. Saving graces. Okay, there's one. Oh wow, things just got hyper laggy. Oh, well, let's let's pause that for a second. 
Oh, touche, Skellies, touche. any of this. Oh. I didn't have the full knockback resistance. That would have been a very... Oh, witches. That would have been a very, really scary time. Yeah, bugger off. Okay, so what are those boots? Uh, the boots are... Just diamond boots for curse binding. Now well, that those won't be worn anytime soon. Not while we have the ounce of feathers. Okay, where were you spawning from? Oh, up there. That makes sense. Objective four or five. If I can get at least half the objectives for this particular role today, I would be more than overjoyed. Bugger off. I don't know what that leads to. That leads to intersection three, which is actually really good news for us. And I'm definitely not taking that minecart. You take me for, for a fool, fool, Wiggy. Darkness unknown. Well, thanks, Wiggy. Um, thanks for the nausea. Actually, maybe going back to the intersection and dropping stuff off might be for the better. Um, especially if I can get back to this top of the area real quickly. Okay, it seems safe so far-ish. I'm waiting for the activator rail, which would have caused our demise. There it is. There it is. Well, that's a whole ton of void that I'm glad I avoided. Thanks, Wiggy. <laughs> You're a champ. Though, actually, I don't think this would have activated anything, realistically. Oh, no, it's probably pissing there. Yeah, there it is. Dodged a bullet there. Sorry, no intersection. Just trolled you. Wow, Wiggy. Wow. You're the worst. Okay, well, that was a waste of time. Uh, I'm luckily lucky that I did not ride the rail track because that would have just killed me. Right into the void. This, boys and girls, is why you... Check your rail truck before you ride it, because some map makers are the worst. <laughs> the absolute worst kind of person. Um, drop off you. There's stuff in here I want to drop off, but at the same time, it's really good to have, or will be really good to have. Okay, let's see if I can deal with this. Uh, there's that chest there I didn't see. Uh, Darkness unknown. I assume where the fifth wall is going to be. We'll get into a better spot. Uh, any pants? No pants. Sad days. Okay. This is an exceptionally dark area here, and without pants, this might be a pain in my butt.
Um, I want to deal with this. Oh, that's a lot of creepers. That's a lot of creepers. Skelly. Shield, half durability. I think we'll manage. It's just gonna be a pain in the butt. And we more or less just have to kind of slowly torch it all up. I almost want to kind of sprint in there and just do some lighting and deal with the repercussions after. Ah! <laughs> oh, I'm getting a little frisky. Oh, there's the wolf. Oh. said not being a little frisky hurt. Afterburner of tomorrow. Mine is 80% max health, mine is 50% speed, 500% attack damage, 100% knockback resist. I'm gonna grab it. Still seems terrible. I'm gonna grab it. Grabbers, don't mind me. Just gonna run on, run my way on through. Uh, okay, so that didn't work out as terrible as I anticipated. Um, we avoided death via the uh, rail line. We got three of the five wolves, which is fantastic. I would say this is a productive episode. I probably would have said that with two wolves, <laughs> but. I thought this was a productive episode. Uh, fire resist. Let's go. Alright, let's get out of here. Or try our best. Don't know where... I assume one of them, one of the wolves would have at least been in that water area. The other one, I haven't the slightest clue. Um, we could have messed it on our way up here, possibly. Um, that's always a possibility. Um, could have been... Um, I'm thinking it's either down in that water area or we messed it up here. Um, I think those are the two options that at least come to mind initially. Hi, witch. Don't mind me. Oh, you did... You minded me. Come on, witch! This is not how the game works! Okay. How's it going? When are you mailing me? Mind your own business. Okay. Man, if I found that second wall on the way back, I would be so glad. <laughs> Probably not going to, but I would be glad. Realistically, I could probably jump over into this lava here and swim over. Oh, there's a chest there. Lots of virus potion. Well, 
Thanks for the thought, Wiggy. Ow. Thanks for the thought. chance we're gonna have to run through here again just due to the fact we're missing two objectives uh, but it doesn't stop us from at least clearing some stuff just potentially make it easier for us in the long run could I have missed a oh you silly mamma cubes could I have missed a box, wool box, outside of the one that was most likely in that water area. Hmm. High fire. Emergency, emergency alarms. You probably can't hear it, or if you do, it's very faint. There's a emergency vehicles. noise as they do it's the problem with living in a bigger city <laughs> it's never quiet okay all right trying to keep an eye out for places that might be wool boxy not seeing them Good chance I just missed the, uh, missed one or they're, like I said, they're both down there. Uh, okay, well, we... Well, there's a lot there. We managed to get ourselves three wolves. I'm not going to scoff at that. I think that's a productive episode. Uh, so let's drop these off and call it there for today. Boom. Four, five, and three. I would say that's pretty productive. Um, so yeah, that's going to do it for today, everyone. Thanks for joining, as always. I'll catch you all next time. Bye!